and welcome to History Pod. On the 4th of December 1956, the Million Dollar Quartet, featuring Elvis Presley, Jerry Lee Lewis, Carl Perkins and Johnny Cash, was recorded during an impromptu jam session at Sun Records Studios in Memphis, Tennessee. The four recording stars had not planned in advance to meet at the studios. Carl Perkins and his backing band had gone there to record some new material to follow up the success of the song Blue Suede Shoes, while the still relatively unknown Jerry Lee Lewis had been invited by studio owner Sam Phillips to come along and add some piano to the tracks. Elvis Presley had been signed to Sun Records until November the previous year, when his contract was bought out by RCA Victor. By chance, he dropped into his former label to catch up with Phillips. Having listened to the playback of the Perkins sessions, Elvis decided to enter the studio and begin jamming with the band. Before long, another Sun artist, the country musician Johnny Cash, arrived and joined in the jam. The quartet primarily played snippets of old gospel and spiritual songs that they'd grown up with, including at least one request from Elvis's girlfriend, who had joined them in the studio. Studio engineer Jack Clement, who had discovered Jerry Lee Lewis, was in the control booth and decided to record the session. At the same time, Phillips called a local newspaper to photograph and report on the impromptu meeting. The subsequent article was the first use of the name the Million Dollar Quartet. It was the first and only time that these pop music pioneers would ever record together. <laughs>